Hello, Cleveland! No, it's not a rock show. This is an important message about Lake Erie. You know that big green thing to the north there? The lake is currently undergoing one of the worst algae blooms in decades, turning the water to scummy bright green colour. Ugh. The exact reason behind this bloom is a little bit unclear, but scientists like myself believe it could be linked to increased rainfall and believe it or not, mussels. Not the mussels like I have from going to the gym, but the little uh, the bivalve, the little creature lives in the water. The zebra mussel and the quag mussel have invaded the lake, and they feed on phytoplankton instead of algae, making it even easier for the blooms to occur. This is according to NASA. They know this stuff. While the algae doesn't directly kill the fish, it is not good for them. As the algae dies, it is broken down by bacteria, and this uses oxygen, which it takes from the water. This oxygen removal creates areas where the fish cannot survive. And in addition, if it is consumed, this nasty green algae, it can create flu-like symptoms in people, or even kill your pets. Nobody wants that. According to NASA, blooms like this uh, did occur before in the 50s and 60s, but now phosphorus from farms and sewage runoff and industry have fertilized the waters, making all this algae stuff grow. Ugh. Now what can you do about it? Well, right now you can go to SaveLakeErie.com and, you know, see what they say about it. You can find out more, including what you can do. It's always important to take action. Anyway, this is Professor Hans von Puppet for Lake Erie. Let's try to keep it a little less green, you know? It's not easy being green. Oh, I'm mixing metaphors. Oh, I'm such an old fart. Anyway, go to SaveLakeErie.com right now.